Good morning children. I hope you have enjoyed the shadow show. You must have observed that there are some words which are spelled with TCH in the end and some have just CH. Both they make the same sound CH. Then how can you know when to use TCH? So let's understand the difference between CH as in teach and TCH as in catch. So for this there is a rule catch a bunch rule. What is this? When there is only one vowel by itself and the word has the sound ch, we usually use TCH. Like for example, here you can see the word catch. Here there is a vowel A which has no letter friend after it and you hear the sound ch. So when the vowel is alone by itself and you hear ch sound, then you write T C H. See the next example. Stitch. Now here the vowel is I and it has no letter friend. So after I you hear ch sound. So it is stitch. S T I. Then we add T C H. And when the vowel is not alone, means there is a letter friend with the vowel, then we use CH. For example, beach. Now here the vowel is E. And after E, there is a vowel friend A. Then we write CH with it. Next the word is touch. Again, you can see the vowel O and there is a letter friend U with it. And O is not alone. So, we write CH with it. See another example. The word is munch. Munch. Now see, after the vowel U, there is a letter friend N. So, we use CH with it. But you have to remember there are only five such words that break the rule. And these words are rich, such, much, which and sandwich. Now take out your my English Reader book, page number 34, write down the date and the day at the top. Let's start. Say TCH as in catch. Let's read. The first word is hatch. Hatch means when the young ones come out of the egg. It is called hatch. Next is match. Match is a cricket match, a football match or match is also a match stick which you see in the match box. Next is batch. Batch is a set or a group of things like a batch of newspaper or batch of flowers. Right? Next is catch. Catch the ball. Catch means to hold. Next is patch. Patch is a piece of cloth used to mend a torn cloth. Like here you can see there is a shirt and there is a red patch 
on it. Next is scratch. Scratch is a mark or a wound made by scratching. Next word is watch. Watch is to look at something or to observe something. And there is another meaning of watch that is a wrist watch. Now the next word is fetch. Fetch means to go for and then bring back something. Like the dog ran to fetch the bone. Next is itch. Itch is an uncomfortable sensation on your skin when you want to scratch. Next is hitch. Hitch is to move with a jerk. Next is pitch. Pitch is the sound or the tone of one's voice. Next is witch. Witch is an ugly bad woman. You can see the picture of witch on the page. Next is stitch. Stitch means when you use needle and thread to sew or knit something. It is called stitch. And the last word is switch. You can see the picture of switch here on the right side on the top. Switch is a button which is used to switch on or off the electric circuit. I hope all these words are clear. Let's learn some new words. So, some more words with TCH. Stretch. See, when you do exercises, you stretch your body. Next is snatch. See here, in this picture, a man is snatching the purse. So, snatch. Snatch means to take away. Next is a stretcher. A stretcher is a bed to carry sick or injured people. You see stretchers in the hospital. Next is a crutch. A crutch is a long stick used as a support under the armpit by a lame person. I hope you have understood TCH sound. Thank you.